Hi everybody, welcome to my new video. Uh, this is Battlecatter 3 and we're doing some engineer PvP on the Guild Wars 2 beta. I made two videos uh, last week that were put on Machinima Realm and both of them entitled uh, the differences and the opinions that I had on World of Warcraft versus Guild Wars 2 and I said I would put up some more videos and these is the result. We've got about six to, six, six to eight videos to go through and the first one I'm doing now is the engineer PvP gameplay. Um, it is quite fun playing the engineer class and I'm going to go over a few different topics while you can see some of the highlights that I got from this weekend and some of the clips that we got. And understand not all the clips are me absolutely killing some everybody but a lot of them are and um, I want to go over some fundamentals of the engineer, how it works in PvP, and how I felt about it. Um, I didn't really know how to play the engineer. This is the first battleground I ever did, and the um, first time I ever played the class. So it was actually quite interesting to see how I'd come across. And just there, I actually got the pushback kill while using the pushback ability, just after reading over them, and got the first kill of my engineer. And um, we actually progressed further on to have his friend come through. So what I mean is the engineer has four different, or from my understanding currently, there's a few different turrets and things that engineers can use in order to kill their opponents. Um, there's like a healing turret, there's a turret you can use on your um, passive side, which is the right hand side of the action bars, and then there's offensive turrets on the left hand side entitling the F1, 2 and 3 and 4 keys, and they're really really good to use. Um, they can heal you as well as pressing 6, which does a healing, um, healing little turret and they're really uh, versatile to use and they actually do, do a lot of damage so as you can see here we're just fucking tearing the shit out of that guy do you see that bang and he's dead straight away so we killed this guy flat um using the turrets properly and using all the spells properly and he died really really quickly and easily and um it just shows how well structured the engineer is and using clips so i really i really enjoyed actually playing this class I also enjoyed it because you can feel really defensive, so like here everyone's fighting and I'm just sitting back just um, with my turret attacking, dealing constant damage, the damage is really constant, like it never really fades out, and you can use your um, turrets as their own little defense mechanism, because people often aim for them to kill them first when you're attacking, and you can actually blow them up and such, so it's actually really cool to use them. So yeah, the engineer does use a lot of potions and such as well, and that's on the right hand side of the action bar, but I didn't use them and I just use the basic um, mechanics now. And the class actually is really good in PvP, and everything's so balanced, especially at, at this level here. So as you can see, we're still fighting everybody, and I just laid down my turrets and started um, killing as many people as I can, and using some of the pushback techniques in order to get them into a fundamental position that we could kill. And we got two killing blows there, but I didn't actually go in to finish them, but we did get the kills there. So um, yeah, you can see I got a, quite a bit of kills throughout the whole um, clip here. Now this one, this guy is an elementalist, and I wanted to put this clip in, even though I did die, is because of like, how well the survivability is in this class because that's a lot of that's a big aspect for a lot of people so the elementalist here isn't that good but neither am I you know first BG um, ever playing the engineer class ever and this guy has a tornado and I didn't even know what this was so it was actually, it was actually quite see, good to see how the engineer goes up against different classes and the engineer was um, a great one to go against especially when fighting an elementalist um, you can put down a lot of your totems sorry not totems your um turrets in order to kill them and do some additional damage just like I did there and heals um, whilst trying to kill them and that's really helpful but using your primary function your primary attack is really really I can't emphasize it enough if you're ever going to play the engineer because it really is like a fundamental thing that you're going to use constantly it's just really really helpful and really, really good to use um, <laughs> really really so you want to be using those type 4 attacks and there's also a net ability that you can have to net somebody and capture them which is pretty cool um, so all in all you can actually Stop your, stop your foes from moving, you can heal yourself in combat, which makes you really versatile. So as you can see here, I'm surviving, we're going one on one for ages here, he's doing damage, I'm doing damage, you can see both our life bars, and then he hits me out with his AoEs and such, but I come back alive, and he runs away, and, and I'm about to die here, he's got me burning, and I somehow come back, drop a supply crate, and you know, it's it's really cool, that supply crate's actually awesome, an ability you can get is to drop like all these turrets and, and heals, and you can rejuvenate yourself while attacking your opponent. So it's it's really versatile, the engineer. It feels good. The whole game feels great, even though there's a little bit of lag still. And um, it's it's actually really smooth playing the engineer. And it's strong. It's really strong in PvP as well. As you can see, that that time when we dropped the other guy, it was really cool. Um, just to see how the turrets tied in and how you can use them as diversions and stuff as well. So definitely pay attention to that. It's It all comes in in the end. Um, for an end result, and I just used, I just threw the net there, and it didn't really have much an effect, but it does when you're trying to kill like a guardian or something and get away from them, so it is quite versatile. If you want more, then please come to my channel, subscribe there, so if you're going to go view the channel now, hit the subscribe button, uh, there's plenty of PvP content and such, If otherwise, enjoy it, and uh, thanks.